Hey, I'm KIC, and those office employees are just tap, tap, tapping away at the keyboards. Can you hear them? Yeah. They are getting real work done. Look at that. That is exciting. We're getting close to being able to sell appliances. I am looking forward to that because I was an idiot and built a store and tried to lay out appliances and found out we couldn't. Whatever, it's fine. I'm not going to sweat it. Let us start building a foundation. Yep, yeah, I've decided... The heck with it, we're going to start on this today. Now, whether we stop right here, I don't know. This might be as far as we get. It's entirely possible that I do this and then just say, oh, no, no, do that too. And then say, nope, we're done. So that's going to cost us just under 130 grand. I mean, come on. That is going to be a huge chunk of change. That's going to take uh, maybe a day or two to build. This is... Insofar as we are currently concerned, our largest building to date. The plan, of course, because I've been talking about it for what feels like an eternity, is a grocery store, and suddenly I have Iron Maiden in my head if eternity should fail. If you know the song, sing it along with me. Oh, uh, wait a minute, I can't remember the words. Hmm. How does that go? I can't think about it. I can't think of what it is now. Here is the story of a... No. Here is the soul of a man. Eh, something like that. That's kind of how it starts. Here is the soul of a man. Except it's Bruce singing it, so he doesn't like go low like I do. Bruce is more of a tenor, not baritone. Is that right? Do I have my, do I have my singing types right? I think I do. Whatever. Anyway... Let's see where we are. 76%. Let's check out our needs. These are still just kind of confounding me. We don't have a need for laptops, and yet we do have them. Okay, it's fine. Look at that. Go, bust, 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 go, 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 go. Question that I have right now is what do we do here once we're done with this? I kind of want to go to road network number two, and yet I'm not entirely certain we're ready to deal with that. So if we don't, then do we go to media supplier, which I kind of would really like to do. Because I like the idea of selling video games, especially if the big major game release is coming up. But I don't think it's going to be possible. And I could be wrong, but I don't think it's going to be possible to get that done. Actually, what do we what do we have going on here? What do we, what do we, what do we have? 23 man hours is what that is taking right now with an average progress of 29.2 man hours. So technically, if we have the money kicking around... We could actually sell video games. We could turn this into a video game store before it ever opens. And we could try to capitalize on that, uh, on that big video game release. Let's go to our entertainment. No, you're a uh, media and toys. We don't really have video games covered. We could leave this at game consoles. That'd be fine. TV sets, MP3 players. We could change that. That's not a huge deal. I'm okay with that. I mean, we could technically, I mean, if we really want, we can move some of these things around here. I don't know. I'm just kind of looking at this going, we can move some of the stuff around. Let's kick time. Time, we're kicking you. Get moving. Is that Polly? Polly. Yeah, Polly's pretty awesome. See, she's not hanging around. She's working. She is chopping down trees and drilling in floors and drilling in walls and... She's doing a lot of things with that drill. She's drilling down trees, I guess, if you want to be technical about it. All right. Like I said, this store is going to take a while to build this, this foundation. I'm a little concerned that if I decide that I want to switch all of these guys out, I mean, one, these pallets kind of go to waste, and that's fine. This is almost done. Look at that. 96%. It's about to be complete. There it is. Boom. Boom. Let's go to media supplier. Are you going to be able to switch tables out in time? I mean, we still got a day to go here. I, I just, I would kind of like to get it rolling now, just because this, this store has just been kind of... Oh, man. All right, I'm going to do it. 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 I know I wasted all this money on pallets, and then we're going to have to just... Actually, you know what? Here, hold on. Cancel, cancel that. Can I... Can I move that instead? Can I... Can I uncancel that? How do I do that? Can I? Hmm. Can I? Can I uncancel? Pallet. Where? Where are my pallet store? Pallet. Pallet. 
Can I, can I uncancel that? Okay, perfect. I'm just thinking, since we have this gigantic store, maybe what we can do is we can just kind of move all of the pallets over to here. Can I, I cannot select all of these at once, can I? That's fine. Maybe we'll end up selling some appliances in our grocery store. I mean, it's going to be a pretty big store. Maybe not as large as I would really like, but you know what? It's fine. Let's go ahead and try this. I'll see if these folks will move them. They might. I don't know, because they already kind of have this order in place. Ah, oh, technically they're already moved. Okay, perfect. Well, good. What do we need then? We need shelves. Shelves are going to sell us, sell us, allow us to sell, my goodness, easy for me to say, books and video games. So we're going to sell some books and video games. And we're going to do basically four games, two books. And then we might end up moving... I want to say we move that table, and let's put that in here. We're going to need tables anyway, so we'll add another shelving unit in here. We'll just go ahead and rotate you. Perfect. There we go. This is how we're going to roll. You guys, you're going to switch out for Polly. Polly's going to come in and do a good chunk of work. Everyone's going to be ready to go by about tomorrow-ish, I suspect. Womp, womp, womp. Look at that, Polly. Polly's just knocking this crap out. I kind of want another builder. Because we don't really need another builder. That's the thing. Polly's taking a break. Polly's coming back. There you go. Keep on... Keep on rocking, Polly. And then we'll have your, your morning crew come in here momentarily. They should be rolling in any time now. This building is going to be done today, which means that they're going to get these shelves in place. Oh, they already are! They already are! Okay, so media supplier. This should be done today. Oh, no, it's not. Crud. Uh, we're not going to make that in time, are we? Oh, uh, crud. Can we, can we, like, put you into overdrive? I don't think there's a way to do that. Hmm. Nope. There's, there's nothing I can do about that. We're not going to have media supplier done. That's okay. That's all right. Whatever. You guys, you'll... We're going to end up missing... We're going to end up missing out on it. That's, that's fine. That's obnoxious, but that's fine. We might be ready to open in the middle of the day or something. Here, let's go ahead and, at least for the time being, I think what I want to do is take this store over here. Call me yes. Let's check our staff out. We need all of our cashiers. And we don't really have them staggered in a way I quite like, but we do have a little overrun such that I don't think we need to have as many people in here as we have. So 1,409, we're going to transfer them over to, I'm going to transfer you over to this store over here. Let's transfer you to the unnamed at this point store. And we're going to transfer, transfer, transfer. Bleh. Easy for me to say. Uh, nope. Let's not reassign storage. My bad. Um, zone. No. Staff. Staff! That's what we need to do. We need to transfer our staff. Let's transfer... Transfer. My goodness, I can't even speak. This is terrible. It's a tragedy, a travesty, a whatever is D. Uh, let's do it so that we have a little bit of overlap. I... I'm okay with that, so we'll do, we'll give you an extra hour, and then we're going to go over to this store, and we'll manage this one. We'll go to staff, and we need to have, uh, we got to actually manage the store. Let's have it open at 10 and close at 8 o'clock. That'll be fine. We'll go our staff. Let's see who comes in later. Rob, you're going to come in a little later. Something like that. You don't need to be as working, you don't need to be working as many hours as you are. Uh, We'll do something like that. And we're going to hope that that's fine. We are going to need a brand new stock clerk. Oh, I'm going to say... Um, Carl, you have pretty decent experience as a stock clerk. That'll be fine. We'll have you come in. Uh, let's have you just come in a little late like that. That'll be okay. Actually, you know what? No, we'll have you come in in the morning. That's fine. So theoretically, um, 
let's assign storage. That needs to be done. And then there we go. So I did want to reassign storage on that one. Good. Got it. Okay. Yeah. Now we're going to go ahead and start loading things up here. I know. We're going to have empty tables, but at least we can kind of get some people in here and working, more or less. That'll that'll be good. I'm, I'm fine with that. I'm a little concerned here about people being able to take breaks. We might end up bringing in one additional employee, something along those lines. We shall see. How close are we on our research? 94%. Oh my gosh, we're so close. We're going to be able to take advantage of it, but not as much advantage as I would like. Part of me is thinking, maybe we just open a little late here. I kind of... Or maybe we, we start the manage... We, we start the office a little earlier. Uh, I mean, we could technically work these people for more. We just spend more money that way. Uh, let's have them come in a little earlier. Office workers, you come in at 7 now. I, I want to take advantage of this day. And I feel like if I have you all come in at 7, I'll be able to take advantage of that. And we'll be able to actually get the store open and running. With books and video games. And, I don't know, maybe a DVD or two. Ready to go. What are we doing in there? Game consoles, game consoles. You know what? Part of me wants to move this. Let's relocate this guy over to there. I'm not sure how that's going to work considering there's no door on the building. Don't think about it too hard now. We'll just go ahead and put a staff door in here. We need to actually, here, before we do anything else, let's just start working on walls. We need to have a storage location back here. So I'm thinking we do storage like, uh, oh shoot, what do we do here? One, two, three, four, five. That'll give us three by three by twelve. Is that enough? I feel like that should be enough. I feel like that should be enough storage. If you heard the little whoop, that'd be Discord. Pay no attention to that. Okay, so we're going to need a staff door in place. So we'll put the staff door. Oh. Uh, put the staff door right there. We need to add some additional parking. So we're going to do a loading zone right here. And then we'll do just staff only parking all the way across. Okay, let's do a road right here. It's going to say, what do you mean I can't build that? Because my mouse went too low. Got it. All right, we're going to do all staff parking over here. And then, man, we're going to need some additional parking probably on this side. So let's do, let's start on that right now. Let's start on some customer parking. We'll just do a little bit right there because this is going to be a nightmare once this gets up and running. I mean, I, I have no doubt about that. I would really like to put this gigantic fountain down, but I cannot afford to do that. So we'll do this one lone oak tree. I like that tree. It's nice. Uh, this, I'm going to leave it. You know what? I'm fine with it. I am fine with it. It looks silly. I'm okay with it. This store, if you didn't know already, is going to be... Oh, see. I had a feeling it was going to correct itself. It's going to be a bit of a long-term project. In case it's not obvious. We only made nine grand yesterday. Okay. So close to getting media supplier done. I just... I am, like, chomping at the bit here. Let's get to our stuff. Okay. Oh, look at that. We're done. Just like that. I told you if we were quick about it, we could get it done. Okay, then that brings on the question, what do we do next? I say, I say, what do we do? Could do tool supplier. That might be kind of fun. I've been ignoring luxury supplier just because, uh, not because I don't want to do it, uh, just because I, it's kind of one of those things I've done before, and uh, we've already done restaurants one. That unlocks fast food restaurants. Restaurants two, we've done restaurants two. That unlocks fine dining. I, we're starting to get into things, a lot of things I've done before, so I'm not sure how much we want to do that. 
Oh, I don't know. I mean, maybe we just say the heck with it and we go with Road Network 2. Part of me wants to do Security 2 just to unlock self-balancing scooters. I want to see all these people on segways. That is going to make me giggle just a little. Vidya Games. Let's do our Vidya Games right there. That is our Vidya Games. We're going to do a books. And I do want to do one more shelf in here. So where is my... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. What, are, what did I see here? <gasps> the kitchen pass. Ah. Oh, fine dining cooking range. Oh, yeah. We're, get, we're gonna get there. Don't you worry. We are getting there because I do want to mess with that, too. I am so looking forward to that. You have no idea. Uh, we're probably going to need some security over here. So where is our... Let's go to our uh, security... Security, security, I think we're going to need a new security member. So these people all kind of come in around the same time-ish. Let's go ahead and... Ah, that's nice. Look at that. I like that. Uh, let's do a new... Let's hire a new guard. Let's see, who's a good security guard? Oh, you're pretty good. I like you, Sean. Oh, wait a minute, Justin. Uh, you're pretty good, too. All right, so we're going to hire Justin. And let's see, 14, 14, and 14, and 6. Okay, so you come in at 14, and you come in for 6 hours. Actually, you know what? Here, we'll just... Uh, well, actually, I, I don't know. Let's, let's say that's fine. Okay. So we have a little bit of an overlap. So look at that. Shift planning, that looks fine. Okay. I'm good with that. Oh, interesting. You can get a profitability. Average recovered value. So they are just nothing but money sinks. That is fascinating. Thank you. I had no idea. Let's assign some crap and let's put some anti-theft tags on all of this stuff. Thank you. Thank you. Here, let's go ahead and assign books to this guy. Oh my gosh, look at this store. The store is just amazing today. I'm glad we got it open. It's unfortunate that we only have uh, one clerk going. Um, yeah, we are losing so much money today. Yep. And especially because people are just stealing crap left and right. Minor details aside, where is our... Your delivery? Where's our... Uh, don't we have... Hmm. Patrols. All right, we need to have a patrol. I feel like I need to maybe remove some of these things in here. Let's have a patrol like that. So we're going to do that. There we go. Okay, I'm good with that. I feel like I've kind of had that all screwed up, so that's fine. Okay, done. That store is closed. Uh, we, ha we haven't named it. What? what? What do we name this one? I don't know. I'm a little concerned that staff took off early. Because you were supposed to stay, but whatever, it's fine. There should be a video game store, by and large. Video game, 60%. So, let's see what we're doing here on money, money, money. Yeah, it's not going to make that much money tomorrow, today. You know what I mean? It's just not going to. But I do kind of feel like maybe we should have another cashier. So, I, I kind of mentioned that I might want to do this in each of the stores over here. So we're going to hire a new cashier. We're going to have your starting hour. Something like that. We'll have you come in at 12 and we'll just have you do kind of a quick day shift, like a little four hour thing, like right in the middle. Theoretically, right at prime time. That's kind of my thought. And then we'll come over to this store where we're also going to hire a third cashier. We'll hire a cashier. I need to play more with the shift planning. Is that a new thing? I feel like that might be a new thing. I mean, we have the events. That was definitely a new thing that I hadn't seen before. I feel like maybe that is too. Here, we'll have you come in at 12 as well. And then that way we kind of have our people covered for shift or uh, for breaks and all that sort of stuff. Oh, look at that. I kind of like that. That is, I feel like this is a new thing. And if it is, oh, this is so much better. So, so much better. Oh, uh, 
Okay, so we have a little bit of overlap there. You know what? I'm going to do that way. I feel like that's a little better. Let's come to this store and do some shift planning, which is basically what I did over here, except I kind of did it a little differently. All right, I, I'm spending too much money in the other store, but I think it might be open longer too. What are your hours? Yeah, the store's open longer. That's why, because it's open until 10 o'clock. This one's only open until 8. We'll see if we end up leaving money on the table. How much? How many queues did we have full? 21 in that store. That's insane. Let's see how we are doing on our needs, though. Video games, we are hitting pretty well. Okay. Books, we're not really hitting yet. Uh, I suspect that we'll start to see that take care of itself a little more as today rolls along. Let's look at our upcoming events here. Let's just keep the game rolling. Major movie release. We don't have movies on sale. We should probably do that. I did have the thought that it would be nice to have movies in addition to books. But we can do a movie store in a bookstore. We got Mother's Day coming up. Candies, cosmetics, and fine dining. Father's Day, liquor and power tools, huh? Those things go together like... Well, like liquor and power tools. I mean, really. Wait a minute, why did you come in so early? You came in like a whole hour early. What's up with that? Okay, whatever, you're fine. And open the store. We are open for business. Come on in, come on in. Buy stuff. Buy my stuff. How are we doing on the... Security number two. Okay. Uh, I just don't have the willpower anymore. Don't have the energy. I, I can't break their legs. There are too many of them. So, so many. I feel like this store is going to end up making more money than this one, which is silly. I mean, maybe it's not silly, but I just feel like this store has potential to make so much money, and yet... It just doesn't make as much as I think it should. And yet, here we go with this one. I don't know. Do you think it's going to make up, make more money by the time the day is out compared to it did yesterday? I feel like that's a real possibility here. I really do. We've got to start working on this store. This has been a long-term project, and I'm just kind of neglecting it. Let's pause for station identification and figure out where we're going to place stuff. So we're going to build one big double door, kind of like the idea of, actually, you know what? Let's do double doors on the sides. We're going to do double doors just like so. Um, like that. I think that means that's going to go on those two, and then that'll leave room for security tags. That'll be fine. I want to make sure we have some room for security tags. And then uh, we're going to need a bunch of shelves and other things here. This this is going to be... Uh, it's going to be whatever it'll be. No product selected. No kidding, because this technically isn't a store yet. I'm still thinking about what I want to call this one. I think I have a name for it. Let us... Call this one. Hmm. Call this one Sprained Thumbs because they they focus on console games because we have video game consoles in here. Got it? Because if it were computer games, then it'd probably be Carpal Tunnel. Carpal Tunnel Store CTS? I don't know. Something like that. Have, have we finished on the research? No, okay. And I haven't seen security staff rolling around doing stuff. They're just kind of standing around. Why are they standing around? Oh, well, that's dumb. Oh, no, wait a minute. Okay, hold on. So can I only assign you to one at a time? Where are you? Oh, look at him! Go! 
Break his legs! Break his legs! Good job, Justin, I think. Did you... Wait a minute, did, did you actually do anything? I don't know if you did anything. Okay, so, today I have learned that I need to actually assign them to stores. So noted. Alright, I clearly did not pay any attention whatsoever to how... how this worked. Got it. Okay. Now, I kind of wish you would go from store to store. That would be helpful, because... Um... Is that how that works? I don't... I don't understand what I'm doing here. Does that... does that actually work? I don't know what that does. I guess I need to spend more time looking into security and figure out how that works. Uh, we definitely need to have someone over in this store, though, I think. Because, um... Yeah... That, that's where all the, the thievery happens, is all in that store. I mean, at this point, this store is all closed, so it's kind of like, ah, whatever. This store's still open. It shouldn't be. Because there, there are no cashiers, because they all left. Oh, I don't know what that's all about. Whatever. We got spring coming up. Start of spring. It's coming. It's going to be here for the next episode. And I'll catch you on that one. Until then, thanks for watching. See you later.